Samsung has updated its new Galaxy Note 10.1 tablet to fit the times, and here it is. I'm Jessica Dahlcourt with CNET. Here is your first look. This 2014 Wi-Fi edition of the Note slides in a usual stylus so that you can freeform draw, write, and multitask. But it also includes a higher resolution screen, an 8-core processor, a TV remote, and an Android 4.3. Design-wise, you're looking at a lighter, thinner tablet than before, though at 1.2 pounds, it's still heavier than some. The design is a lot smaller than last year's model. In fact, if you sheared off the sides, then this year's Note is pretty much what you'd get. Its proportions resemble the Samsung Galaxy S4 flagship phone, but then it adds this kind of cheap-feeling faux leather cover that you're going to start seeing on other Note devices going forward. The tablet's 10.1 inch super clear LCD screen gets a 2560 by 1600 resolution. Colors are bright and text and images are both clear and sharp. If you must use your tablet as a camera, then both the 2 megapixel and 8 megapixel shooters take quality shots. It uses Samsung's fairly extensive modes, you can get filters, and there's a way to insert yourself into a picture. Gameplay was good on the processor, and there were strong graphics. Note that some versions of the tablet will have a quad-core chipset instead of this 8-core processor, especially if you get a carrier version with LTE. Now, what about this S Pen? I'm glad you asked. You can bring up this Air Command palette on any screen to quickly access tools. One new trick will turn memos into phone calls, emails, and map settings. Another one will let you temporarily open apps on top of the screen you're on. There's also a universal search tool that's called S Finder, and there are the usual multitasking windows as well. Samsung's beautifully redesigned S Note app makes taking notes much simpler and more enjoyable than before, with brand new templates and a cleaner, more legible interface. Without a doubt, the new Note 10.1 has a load of high-end features, but it also has a premium price. The Wi-Fi version costs $550 for 16 gigabytes, and $600 for the 32 gigabyte Wi-Fi model. Once again, I'm Jessica Dahlcourt for CNET, and you can read all the pros and cons of the new Samsung Galaxy Note 10.1 tablet in my full review at CNET.com.